Generative artificial intelligence is a computer technology capable of creating text, images, audio and videos incredibly quickly. You access generative AI through a chatbot. It's like having a conversation. Every time you ask an AI chatbot a question, it predicts what you would like as a response, based on analysing millions and millions of pieces of data that it's already catalogued. Chatbots like Copilot or ChatGPT can be used as assistants that can help with a range of tasks. Getting set up with an account is pretty straightforward. If your school or employer already has guidelines, follow their instructions. Once you're set up, start asking it questions and see how it responds. It's easy to be impressed when it rewrites your CV or plans a round-the-world trip for you in seconds. But before you start relying on it, you need to understand a few key things. Firstly, the responses you get can look and sound very convincing. But that doesn't mean they're right or the information in them is true. Known as AI hallucinations, there have been cases where chatbots have advised users to add glue to pizza, eat rocks or given dubious medical or legal information. Secondly, every time you enter a question or share information with a chatbot, you're helping to train it, making it more intelligent, if you like. So a simple rule is to always ask yourself, am I OK with Google, Microsoft or another technology company storing this information about me forever and potentially using it to train their AI systems? Thirdly, Gen AI uses up a huge amount of energy. Providing an AI response needs about 10 times more electricity than a Google search and vast amounts of water. Remember, generative AI has created a set of handy tools, but they aren't perfect and you definitely need to cross-check everything they say.